Welcome to the .NET Monthly Roundup for June 2024. I'm John Galloway, and I'll bring you all the highlights in just three minutes. All right, we'll start with .NET Aspire. First of all, we've got the Let's Learn .NET Aspire series running June through July. A great series of two-hour events worldwide in a bunch of different languages. They're all recorded, but try and catch them live to get your questions answered. Also, uh, there's a new workshop we wrote for this event with live weather data tracker and stuff. So fun stuff there. Uh, we also have coming up on July 23rd, the .NET Aspire Developer Day, including a keynote, a lot of deep dive sessions, and also community and ecosystem speakers. And finally, we've got a new learning path for .NET Aspire with six new modules there, so definitely check that out. Moving on to AI. First of all, we've got the official OpenAI library for .NET announced here. We also have this great post from Jordan and Luis talking about, well, everything you need to know for generative AI apps with .NET 8. Moving on to tools, we've got the announcement of .NET upgrade assistant support for third-party API and package map. A lot of time when you're upgrading applications, uh, the hardest part is figuring out how to upgrade your dependencies. And fortunately, this now solves that for you. Both Microsoft and third parties can recommend how you should upgrade your dependencies. Also in the Upgrade Assistant, we have Code Assessment. What that does is it'll scan your code and flag issues and recommend how you should fix them uh, using Copilot as well, which is neat. And finally, in tooling, .NET MAUI extension for VS Code is now generally available. Okay, in .NET 9 news, we've got .NET 9 Preview 5 out. A lot of great stuff here. My personal favorite is optimized static web asset delivery. That sets all the proper headers and caching and will deliver uh, optimized compressed files as often as possible. We have this great uh, follow-on. Here in the .NET community standup, we talked to Javier Calvero Nelson, and he showed a lot of code and some great numbers here showing how this impacts your applications. That wraps it up for this month. All the links are in the description below.